And we a weekend trip to Iceland. Over here, there is a viewing platform with a lot of people on it. There obviously must be something to look at. So let's go and have a look. It's going to be an impressive view. Sort of. Uh, so this is where we are. We're going down between two of the Earth's tectonic plates. One that way, and one that way. It's not a tectonic plate, it's a fault line. You used to be able to drive down until 1967. It's impressive and less windy than it was back at the top. So all this area we're looking at, the, uh, the old sort of meeting place for the very old parliament of Iceland. Now we've done the historical bit, it's off to do nature. Right, and we're now at a volcano crater. No, that's ice, because that's supposed to be a lake. Yeah. That those people are on is a lake. Well, it would be a lake if it wasn't frozen solid, because there's a sign that says to the lake. Yeah, I saw that. Well, I don't see any steam oh. or, or lava. Oh, and what, what has she wrote? Or oh, he wrote. Very artistic. And now it's time for the geezers. Quite a big hole, isn't it? <laughs> do you think? Do you think we're in danger of getting wet? No, there's no splash marks here. Sorry? There's no. Uh, it's all. I think where you see the. Um, the no snow. Yeah. And then this is the runoff area, isn't it? Where it's. My nice, good. We can. We so can. I think. I think we. We're, we're safe. Well, we're beyond the rope area, aren't we? So we should be. We can always see people if we're uh, get. No, I wasn't more like I was more like getting wet. It's oh. alright. Yeah. It's eighty to hundred degrees, so it'll have cooled off a bit before it hits. Yeah. That's at 100 degrees, okay, and that one's at zero. Do you know what? That's what I was going to say. How can that be? <laughs> How can that be frozen? And that's and that's boiling up. And now for the final scenic bit of the day, before the Northern Lights, of course. Um, the Gulfoss waterfall.
And now, we're trying to hunt for the Northern Lights. Is that infrared? No, it's not infrared. It's red from the, it's red from the, oh. the thing. If it was infrared, it should be green. So, yeah, so even though we can't pick anything up on the camera, pointing directly ahead is, is a green smudge in the sky that is the Northern Lights. <laughs> yeah, so I'll just Photoshop it in with a green pen. Uh, so, yes, so to prove that we all are like idiots, look, even the camera won't produce you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Honestly, it is a Northern Lights. Honestly, it is a Northern Lights, yes. Yeah. So there are some lights in the van, and there are some lights up there. And we're all, we're all impressed with the Northern Lights. So no, be no, impressed. No, no, no. no, no, me and Paul want a picture of the Northern Lights in the background. Yeah. <laughs> Northern Lights in the background, right, go on. Northern Lights in the background. Yeah, there they are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look, there Northern there. Lights, yes. Where? Where? Yeah. Where? Where? In the sky. Take me. Take me. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least if they come down and take you, then we will definitely be, definitely be light. Not yeah. getting brighter. Well, that's it. They're the Northern Lights for you, and I'm stopping filming because my hand's getting cold. <laughs> <laughs>